Today we are going to learn about jet streams and weather maps. Hello, my name is Elise. On weather maps, they have different symbols like a cold front, warm front, stationary front, occluded front, squall line, dry line, and tropical wave. Also on a weather map, you might see lots of things. For instance, you might find huge cities, seas, large rivers, coastlines, boundaries of low and high pressure, and maybe state outlines. Back to you, Elise. Thank you, Ryan. Now we're gonna learn about jet streams. A jet stream is a long, narrow, wandering current of high-speed winds. Those winds are blown from a generally direction several miles away. Jet streams are moving in the northern and southern hemispheres. That is all for today. Thank you for joining us. Bye. What is a jet stream? <laughs> oink, oink, what is a weather map? Oink, finally, how does a weather map work? Oink, oink, oink. Hi, I'm the Earth, and I'm going to show you about global warming. Thank you for learning about climate change and about ways to make the world a better and safer place. Got it. <laughs>